more action. Yes, that looks right. You've done a lot, Sylvester. This is good. So, listen, just for the record, Sylvester, would you tell these people, have we ever met before? No. No. First time. And Sylvester, did you know that your name was Sylvester? No. No. <laughs> but he does now. Now, this is going to be very painless. You, you just should relax. Now, uh, my uh, second tactic is going to just sort of get a sense of uh, where your most energy is. I'm just going to take in your aura. <laughs> Yes. So, the first thing I'm getting is a little bit of a tiger. <laughs> yes. Man, I really love a tiger. With, with a little bit, I'm sensing a little bit of stallion. Wild, it's like a wheel in your mane kind of wild ride. It's the best and it's also uh, just a little subtle overtones of Sasquatch. It's a wild man. It's a hide and seek in the forest. Yes, yeah, this is good. I think we can work with him, monkey. Okay. So, Sylvester, just have a seat. This is where our real work begins. You know, Sometimes, when you're in this business, it's, uh, it's highs, there's lows, the universe, she comes, she goes. You just have to, you know, read what you can read, feel what you can feel, you know what I'm saying? Oh, the moon music will help. So, this part, I'm going to have to tune in to the energy of the universe to try to predict Sylvester's sexual future. Hold the microphone, monkey. <laughs> Monkey. 
This is very good. Now, Sylvester, what you must do is just relax.